My name is Jack Buffington. I work for First Key. I'm the director of supply chain and sustainability, and I just wrote a book called Reinventing the Supply Chain that talks about the solution of blockchain for supply chains. Jack, uh, we've been here at the Brewers Forum, and you just gave a talk uh, around other panelists, and we talked about how the blockchain was going to uh, you know, revolutionize, if it's used properly, mm -hmm. uh, the beer industry. And uh, what was interesting was uh, your, your discussion about, and apparently you've written an article on its use the amount of craft industry, because when people think of blockchain, they think of big companies, they think right. of, you know, and you say the craft industry, they already have enough in their hands. How can they use blockchains? And you mentioned this could be a renaissance for the craft industry. Yeah, I think it's a great opportunity to level the playing field because blockchain is really just about transactions. And big companies have economies of scale that small companies can't compete against. And blockchain has this ability through decentralized, centralized ledger system to really level the playing field, which could be really exciting for, for craft breweries. So how should the craft industry get into this? Well, what's the first step they should think of doing? You also do say, first, know your business. Exactly. First, um, you have to understand where your business is heading. And the second thing is you have to be educated on where your strategy is heading and how blockchain could help it. But then I think the third piece is there has to be some sort of standardization across the community where craft breweries can come together to, to create a blockchain that would allow them the same fluidity as the large companies. And that leads into the thing, you talk about the big companies having closed blockchain systems and you talk about a public system and you laid down a really good challenge to the Brewers Forum which I'm going to take up on. Great, great. I mean this would be liberating, um, but there has to be standardization in the data because blockchains otherwise are just private contracts and so there needs to be metadata standards for the industry for the small companies to come together. And how, how can you create a public blockchain that craft industry can enter? Well the first thing you need is standards. I think once you have the standards then it's going to be really easy for suppliers to come in and to be able to help small companies become a part of that bigger blockchain. You mentioned the word renaissance. What does that mean? I just think that small uh, craft breweries are having a difficult time competing at retail because there's economies of scale for big companies. Um, craft beer is great beer, um, but if the customer doesn't have an opportunity to buy it, then it's not, you know, the companies can't succeed. So it's this opportunity to level the playing field to show uh, the world what craft companies can do. And just for context, blockchain means supply, getting your supply chain right? Absolutely. Well, it's transparency in your supply chain, which is also fluidity, being able to move from supplier to supplier. Maybe companies can aggregate in their malt purchase or their barley purchase or whatever, um, which is you know the freedom to create these centralized, decentralized contracts on the fly versus big companies have this you know transactional economy of scale. So it's, it's liberating for entrepreneurs, which are craft breweries. Thank you so much, Jack. Thank you. And thanks for talking to the beer idiots. Appreciate it. Thank you.